Hi, I'm Samir. Let us learn few more tricks to multiply two numbers faster. Let us try 203 into 302 as an example. Here our working basis would be 200 and 300 respectively. 2 the multiplier into 100 our base for 203 and 3 the multiplier into base 100 for 302. And our differences would be plus 3 and plus 2. We can now proceed to write down our answer which would be in three parts. The first part would be the simple product of the multipliers which is 3 and 2, 3 into 2, 6. The second part would be the sum of the products of the first multiplier and second difference and second multiplier and first difference which would be 3 into 3 plus 2 into 2, 9 plus 4, 13. And the third part would be the simple product of the differences which would be 3 into 2, 6. Here comes in our rule 1 which says the number of digits in second part or third part will be always equal to the number of zeros in our base. So we'll have to add an additional zero in front of 6 to make it 2 digits. Now we can get our final answer by clubbing these three parts which would be 61306. Let us now try 296 into 793 as an example. Here our working basis would be 300 and 800 respectively. 3 the multiplier for first and 8 the multiplier for second. And our differences would be minus 4 and minus 7. Now let us proceed to write down our answer which would be in three parts. The first part would be the simple product of the multipliers 3 and 8, 24. The second part would be the sum of the products of the first multiplier and second difference and second multiplier and first difference which would be 3 into minus 7 plus 8 into minus 4 which is minus 21 plus minus 32 giving us minus 53 in second part and the third part would be the simple product of the differences which is minus 4 into minus 7 plus 28 but we observe that our second part is negative and as per rule 2 we cannot have any negative in part 2 or 3. So to make it positive we will need to borrow 1 from the first part which will make it 24 minus 1 and we will get plus 100 minus 53 in part 2 which will give us 47. So now we can write down our final answer as 2, 3, 4, 7, 2, 8. Let us now take 396 into 612 as an example. Here our working basis would be 400 and 600 with multipliers 4 and 6 respectively. And our differences are minus 4 and plus 12. We can now proceed to write down our answer. The first part would be the product of the multipliers which is 4 into 6, 24. The second part would be the sum of the product of the first multiplier and second difference and second multiplier and first difference which would be 4 into plus 12 plus 6 into minus 4 which will give us 48 plus minus 24 giving us plus 24 and the third part would be the product of the differences which is minus 4 into plus 12 minus 48. So to write down our final answer we will have to club these parts. But here comes in our second rule which says none of our parts can be negative. So to make the third part positive we will have to borrow 1 from the second part which will make it 24 minus 1, 23. And the third part would become 100 minus 48 which will give us 52. So our final answer would be 2, 4, 2, 3, 5, 2. Thank you folks. See you soon with some new stuff.